Hello, welcome back to another Dan's Food Review. Today we have a new item from, as you could probably already tell, T-Bell. We have Steak Reaper Ranch Fries Burrito. So it's a burrito with Reaper sauce, Carolina Reaper sauce. If you know it's Carolina Reapers are very hot peppers. It has ranch sauce and it has their Taco Bell version of French fries in here too. This was this was three twenty nine at my local Taco Bell, so we'll see. These also come in a just the fries, loaded fries, almost like loaded nachos, but fries with the Carolina Reaper sauce on it. All right, let's give it a go here. I'm not a fan of very hot things, but hot to a certain extent. Looks like your standard burrito. A little bit of weight to it. All right, I'm just gonna dig in here. Okay, I'm getting a little bit of the heat. The sour cream is keeping it, keeping the heat to a minimum so far, but I definitely feel the heat now that's going down. Got some of the fry in there. That was good. Good first bite. That's good so far. I like it. The sauce is just enough kick, but it's there. I don't know if it's Carolina Reaper hot, but it's good. The taste is good. Got some tomato in that bite too. That was good. I'm gonna do one more bite and uh, kind of give an overview and uh, rating. Give you a little inside look. Very appetizing. Tastes better than it looks. The Steak Reaper Ranch Fries Burrito from Taco Bell. I'm digging it. I really like it. The, the heat is good. I'd say the heat's on a level to one to 10. The heat's maybe a five, five and a half. So it's there. I mean, if you don't like hot things at all, you're probably not gonna like it. If you're a fan of hot things, you're gonna like this. Um, the fries are a good throw in there. Sour cream keeps the heat to a nice level, not over overbearing. Um, Sizing is good. The only thing, the price, three twenty nine. I would have liked a two forty nine or two ninety nine on this, but you know, it is what it is. It might be cheaper at different locations. So for as for rating, I'm going to give it a nine out of ten. I really liked it. I would probably get it again. The price is is a little high, like I was saying, but I would definitely get it again. All right, that wraps up another food review. Again, any suggestions? Put them in the comments. Um, I'm willing to do, you know, try pretty much anything, you know, to a reasonable limit. And make sure you hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you next time on another Dan's Food Review. Peace.